Welcome back everybody. Second last question for the test. We're approaching the end. So if x is equal or if f of x is equal to kx cubed minus 2 and f of negative 1, 4, 98 equals 5, we have to find this k value here. Okay, so we have f of x and we're also given some information about the inverse. So we're told that the inverse contains the coordinate 498 and 5, right? The x value is 498 of the inverse, and the y value is 5 of the inverse. Well, if this is the coordinate on the inverse, then we know on the function, the, the function is going to contain a coordinate where the x and y values are interchanged. So it's going to be 5 and 498. So one more time, the inverse contain a coordinate 498 and 5. That means the function contains a coordinate 5 and 498. And now we can use this coordinate and this function that we're given to solve for k. So if f of x equals k x cubed minus 2, we know that f of 5 equals... 498. So what we can do now is we can let 498 equal k and now the x value is going to be 5. So it's going to be 5 to the power of 3 minus 2. And now we can solve for k. So we bring the negative 2 over 498 plus 2 that gives us 500. k 5 to the power of 3 is 125. And then divide both sides by 125 to isolate for that k. We get a k value of 4. So that is the answer right there. So simplest way to do it is to recognize that you can take this coordinate, switch the x and y's, and then plug this coordinate into the function and solve for k. Yo, what's up guys? Thanks for checking out my channel. Hopefully you got some value from the video you just watched. If you did get some value, big favor to ask you, please like this video and subscribe to the channel. Any questions, any recommendations on things you'd like to see, please leave it in the comments section. Also check out the description box below for links to material and content related to the video you just watched. Peace out.